Thank you for joining Fox 54 Plus for this web exclusive of Wellness Wednesday. I mentioned that we had some bonus clips on workouts to stay fit for the Healthy Huntsville Maintain Don't Gain Holiday Challenge. We're going to check out some of those extra workouts. I'm joined now by Amanda Deason. She's the owner of Bar 3. And Amanda, tell us some quick and easy ways to work out, stay fit during the holidays, no matter where you are. Yeah, absolutely. Well, you know, the holidays are a really busy time and we are going and doing and putting everybody on the priority list. And sometimes we tend to be at the very bottom. So, you know, it's really important to be able to focus on yourself, still moving your body, you know, doing something for yourself and something healthy. So um, today we're going to talk about uh, one of the most functional movements and that is a squat. So do you want to do it together? Yes. Okay, great. All right. All right. We're going to set our feet out a little wider than our hips. Oops, okay, and then toes are kind of slightly turned out. All right, so we're gonna just drop down, send your seat back and bend your knees. Yeah, keep your chest nice and proud. And then lift all the way up. You can bring your hands open, palms open. Let's take that to a two count, lower down for two, and then push. So you're using your heels to press yourself up and you're working your glutes, you work your quads, and then the whole time you're bracing your belly and keeping your spine nice and neutral. Now this is a movement that we do every day, whether we're squatting down to pick something off the floor, whether we're picking up a child, a dog, a package off of the uh, front porch, this just helps us to be able to power into our glutes, using core functional movements um, to support our everyday life. Yeah, let's take one more all together, lower down, and then lift up. How'd that feel? Good, that actually got a little workout in. Yeah, woo! <laughs> awesome. That's great. Um, any other advice, any other everyday functional workout uh, exercise that you can think of? Well, absolutely. Um, one of another functional uh, workout that we do is a lunge. Lunges help you to be able to climb stairs, to be able to walk, to be able to, um, you know, uneven terrain uh, or to, to walk on uneven terrain. Um, and so, yeah, well, let's do it together. Okay. All right. Let's just do it one side. We're going to step our left foot forward and then bring your right foot back. Yeah. And then bend both knees down. All right, so your front knee is nice and stacked. And then level your pelvis. And then gauge your abdominal. <laughs> That's okay. And then keep your shoulders right over your hips. So we're just going to take it down for two. And then lift up for two. Yeah, so your back knee just drops right below your hip. And you're pressing down with your back toes. You're going to feel your quad light up. Now you can always take a hinge forward and you're going to press a little bit heavier into your front hip. Yeah. And you're going to notice your hip start to fire up rather than your back quads. So this is a great movement um, to be able to, to prepare your body for everyday life. Yeah. I'm joined now by Rachel Muir. She's with Huntsville Hospital. She's with she's a corporate wellness manager. She's a big part of this healthy Huntsville maintain don't gain holiday challenge. And Rachel, tell us for those who aren't familiar with the challenge, this is their first time hearing about it. The first thing you do is weigh in, right? Right. So this is the tenth year that we are doing this program. Um, it actually started with Huntsville Hospital employees, and now it's spread out to the community. So the first thing you do is weigh in from now until November 24th. So you got time to weigh in. Um, then you're going to maintain your weight throughout the holidays. We're not asking people to lose weight over the holidays, just maintain it. After the New Year's, January 2nd through the 10th, you're going to weigh out. Uh, the weigh-in locations include Huntsville Hospital Wellness Centers in uh, Jones Valley in Madison, and then also um, the local rec centers here in Huntsville. That's awesome. And for those of us who are tempted to get that extra turkey stuffing and pie, because it's very tempting over the holidays, what are some ways to motivate them to keep them going during this challenge? So one thing we try to stress to people is that we're not trying to, don't try to restrict yourself. You're just trying to maintain a balance. So you can still have all the treats that you love. It's just about portion control, balance, and also incorporating some healthier things into it as well. Also about exercise, um, any time that you have an opportunity to get outside, get your steps in, um, get to one of the wellness centers and work out, or one of these rec centers that are throughout town that are amazing, 
um, you know, take the opportunity to move your body um, and that'll help you also to keep going and get your family involved too. You're gonna have lots of people in town visiting, so it's a great way to spend time with your family um, and also watch your weight. Watch your weight. That's it for me. Did you have any other things to add about this challenge? Um, so everyone that weighs out for the challenge will receive a prize. Um, I'm not saying just yet what the prize is, but in my opinion, it's the best one we've had in 10 years.